Rolling into the repair shop next is Tracy. Hello. Hello. How are you? Good, thanks. Who brings a childhood treasure in need of attention. You beauty. I was hoping we were going to get a rocking horse. How are you, Tracy? <laughs> yeah, good, thanks. How are you? Yeah, great, thank you. This is a beauty. Is it still functional or does it still operate? Like, as in. Yeah, it still rocks. Yeah. Um, but the head will come off. What do you mean? Well, it's not meant to, but it's been broken. Oh, no. That is no good at all. It's no. going to be a bit of a rectification nightmare. This is definitely a job for our furniture restoration expert, Britta. Hey. <laughs> Britta, Tracy, Tracy, Britta. Nice to meet you. Yeah, nice what to meet you. Here? It's a beautiful old rocking horse, isn't it? Unfortunately. Yeah, it's seen a few years, hey? This comes off as well. There? Yeah. What do you think oh, about wow. that? Wow. Have Certainly a look. Gonna... Are there any bits missing? It's clearly quite a crack on this side. What saved it from the tip, do you reckon? When it was broken, I think the family were willing to get rid of it, but they always thought it should be cherished because the horse was given to my family by my grandmother back in the late 1950s. I had a special connection to it because I just loved horses. And I always wanted to have a horse when I was a child and we didn't have the backyard to have a horse. So this was the closest I could get. Do you remember role plays you would play? Like I would go and play cowboy. And... <laughs> yeah, absolutely the cowgirl. My mum, she kept that for me for about 20 years. Tell me about Mum, what was her name? Her name was Betty. And she obviously realised how special it was for me, for her to have kept it all that time. We've only lost Mum a couple of years ago, so... Oh, I'm so sorry to hear so that. So, I think losing Mum made me realise that I've got to get this done. Yeah. You feel like you've got forever. I guess that made me realise you don't. And so, if there's something you need to get done, get it done now. It means a lot to me. It's just a cherished memory from my childhood. The connection to my mum um, keeping it for me. I'm hoping that when it's repaired, it would be the way that my mum would have loved it to have been done years ago. Dean is assisting Britta with Tracy's rocking horse. The old headless horseman. The most urgent part of this restoration is to see if the break to the rocking horse's head is beyond repair. Well, you know, they tried to fix it and they didn't quite make that match. Yeah, it's a few mil off. Yeah. Is there a mafia joke in this? Don't know. They try to pull me out. <laughs> <laughs> the dowling idea that they had is pretty good. It was just not executed correctly. We need some kind of structure or connector bits that link the head to the main body because if you just use glue, it's never going to last. You're just going to knock it off. It was kind of like concrete without the mesh, right? You need to put the steel inside the yep, concrete absolutely. for it to have strength. We're going to take the dowels out and try to refit them or new dowels. With the dowels now removed... There we go. Excellent. Britta and Dean will re-drill into the existing holes to enlarge them. Then, expanding glue will be used to fix the dowels into position once the head is aligned. You good to go? Yeah. Grab some clamps. There that's lining go. up here. I think that's good. So we've got lots of clamps in there, so the pressure comes from all sides. Yeah, yeah, that's better. That head's not, not going anywhere. No, I don't think so. I think that's pretty good. Well, the good result, no more headless horse. No. We're good to go. It's not spooky anymore, is it? Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Well done, Britta. I'll leave it with you. Thanks. The repair shop's team of craftspeople have bandied together to rescue a headless rocking horse, and it's nearly ready to be returned to owner Tracy. It's come together a treat. I think even the horse is happy. Something is missing, though. We need oh. a mane and a tail. Hey, Dean. Yeah. Do you want me to do the honour? Do the tail. Tail. That looks like an important job. But this looks legit. What is it? It's a cow's tail. Cow's tail? No. Yeah. Guys, Tracy's en route. Let's get this thing inside. Right, eh? Let's rock and roll. I'll grab the dirty end. <laughs> Steady. Thank you. It looks awesome. 
awesome.